Today, I'm going to be showing you how to replace the LED ballast and LED turn signal unit on this Model 3 headlight. So first thing you got to do is remove the headlight from the car and then get access to the bottom. So here is the LED ballast that drives the, the main, the low beam and the high beam lighting unit. So you're going to need just a T20 Torx screwdriver here to remove these three screws. Okay, once you have the three Torx screws removed, you need to just grab the unit and give it a pull and then flip it over. And once you're once you have it pulled, it's going to be still connected to this wire harness. So here, there's a little tab right here that you need to push down or push in and then grab this lever and pull it up. And then once you have that pulled up, then you have to, with two hands, you're going to need to pull the ballast down and pull this wire connector up and then it will come loose. To replace the ballast, you need to put the wire, heart, the wire connector back in, push it down until it's snug, and then, then you're going to take this wire lock and you're going to push it down until it snaps into place. Once it's tapped into place, it's secure, then you can realign it and push it back into place, push it back into place, and replace your three T20 screws. So that's all you need to do to replace the, the ballast. To replace the LED turn signal unit, you're, also, you're going to also use the T20 Torx screwdriver, and there's going to be one, two, and three screws. So I'm going to go ahead and remove these real quick. Once you have the three screws removed, you just want to grab the unit and give it a pull. And then it will slide right out, and then you need to turn around, and there is a wire clip right here that you're going to just push down with your thumb, and again, pull up on the, the wire clip and down on the, the drive, the LED unit, and then it will come out. And then to replace it, you simply just need to pop the wire clip back in, push it down till it snaps, and then realign, make sure your hole goes over this mount, and then you just want to push it straight in until it's fully seated. Inside of the headlight recess here are two holes that you will then, you need to align these two alignment pins with and then you just want to push this straight back into its socket here and then you're going to need to give it a little bit of a good push so after you give it a good push it will fully seat back in and then you just need to replace your three t20 screws and you're done that's all there is to replacing the ballast and the turn signal LED drive unit. I hope you found this video useful. Thank you for watching.